friends, welcome to today and welcome to a brand new year. It is 2020, the first day of 2020, and we are up and at it, riding horses. <laughs> no. <laughs> Girls just got up. It is, is it only 9.30? No. 10.30? 11.42? 11.42? Holy cow, girls just woke up. Oh, no, we didn't. We were on our phones for like a couple of minutes. Sophia's still asleep. Sophia's still asleep. Hmm, that does not surprise me. Anyway, I have a surprise for you, Kaylee. Just wait till you see. Sam baked homemade, fresh, gorgeous croissants for breakfast. But there were only... That's what I was smelling. But there was only five, so you only get one each. But That's I'm fun. making a really big, huge brunch for us. You're going to have mine. You want butter on it? You got to go to the kitchen. You don't want it? I have oh my gosh. I chocolate on top. Macy's like, give it to me. Oh my gosh, the dogs are outside. Run and let the dogs in. I feel like the cat is not loving all the attention you've been giving her. Can you tell by the way she's she's like But our cat never ever bites. She just tries to run away. So let her run away. She's doing she TikTok. Do TikTok <laughs> yeah, she loves it. I can just tell. Meanwhile, Macy over here is really loving Kaylee. Last night we went live at midnight, just before midnight with you guys. We played trivia. It was so much fun. Horse oh trivia. God. We put the cat in the box. It was... You guys put the cat in a box? Put Gabby put the cat in the box. Oh my gosh. You think at 12 she would actually get it. Today is... Today is Wednesday. Two more days until our new camera arrives. Sparkles on here. Two more days until our new camera arrives. Last night on New Year's Eve, we went live with you guys and we had planned to have all this food, this amazing food. I bought all this food, you guys. I spent like $200 on food just for us. It. Yeah, I'm making it all. It Get it out. out. Yeah, I'm making it all. We're gonna have brunch. It's almost noon. Um, And yesterday, if you guys saw What's the rock. That? That's brie. I'm even making brie. Oh, that's the cheese that Oh, dude, I was gonna cheese. touch it. I thought it was Dyson Clay. You <laughs> said it was. Daiso clay. Okay, this is for breakfast too. Yeah, but not yet. I'm making all of it. No, I'm cooking it all. First. No, not first, Gabby. This is the year of Gabby listens on camera because she let me tell you she listens off camera. Get it away from you. I'm gonna cut it and put it out, and you guys are gonna have brunch. This is our first brunch in this house. Well, it's not cut. You have to cut the squares. Yeah. I'll take it on. No, you're not having it. What she's talking about is Nanaimo bars. If you guys don't live in Canada, you might not know what these are, but they're yum. Um, yeah, we got popcorn chicken. We got we got all this stuff. I wanted to start fresh and clean in 2020, but um, we didn't eat any of it last night, so we're going to eat it now. We're going to have it all, you guys. I have a garlic pizza. It's kind of like a garlic pizza. I have popcorn chicken. I have spinach and artichoke mac and cheese bites. The guy at the store said that when people buy these and try them, they come back and buy all the ones that they have at the store to keep them on hand because they're so good. So I'm excited to try those. We also have the Oriental. Is that Oriental? This is Indian. This is an Indian party pack, you guys. We have never eaten Indian food before. Well, Sam has. He grew up in Toronto. He's eaten everything. But yeah, we're going to try that. I have brie here. We're going to put jam on it. And I have crackers. I'm going to bake that in the oven. This is what it looks like. For any of you guys who have never eaten brie before, it's cheese. And mmm. Bake it. Mm, I'll show you. So that is the Indian party pack. It's kind of got more spicy stuff in it. There's more over there. And this one is the Asian party pack. I always buy that one every year. I also have zesty jalapeno poppers. Cheese bites. So we're going to have those as well. I also bought meatballs and a few other things, but we're going to save those for another day. Um, the reason that we're feed, I'm feeding the girls this big, huge brunch is because I have a plan for them and the horses to start off my New Year's resolution. I'm about to take down our Christmas tree and all of our Christmas decorations um, and say goodbye to 2019. But for 2020, I wanted to tell you guys my New Year's resolution. I kind of touched on it in our live video last night. Basically, for 2020, I... And this is what Stella taught me, you guys. This is what God is putting in my heart. I am going to take a leap of faith. I 
told you guys, you guys all know I am a scared person. I am a scaredy cat. I don't even know why I am. I am nervous and scared of everything. Horses are teaching me to not be afraid. And Stella mostly has taught me that I need to start taking a leap of faith. We took a leap of faith when we moved from our beautiful, nice, big house to this tiny little dungeon of a house so that we have a farm and have our horses here. And it has been such a blessing to me. So I'm going to continue to take leaps of faith. Bringing Sky home was a huge leap of faith. There are going to be so many leaps of faith. Remember every time we went to the sales barn last year and there were beautiful horses that needed us. And I was like, no way. I am way too scared of that. No more scared, you guys. I am not Mrs. Scaredy Girl anymore. I am Mrs. Brave Girl. You guys are going to have to remind me every time. I Every time I go back to safety, but yeah, that is one of my goals. I want us to get healthy again. I want us to do more walking. I want us to do more physical things as a family, even though we are a kind of physical family. But um, I also am going to go out on, I'm going to take a leap of faith. I'm going to walk forward in God. And I hope you guys will join me in that as well as your New Year's resolutions. But anyway, let's get on with the video. So yeah, I bought all this food yesterday for us to eat and then after the riding lesson that the girls had with Brandon, he, he drove them hard. Um, they're like, we're starving, we need KFC. And I caved and I got them KFC and everybody ate KFC and then nobody was hungry. So today is our New Year's, e New Year's Eve food day. I also found this in the freezer, a beautiful container with a mousse filled with chocolate. One thing that I didn't get to show you guys is that one of our friends who made us these Christmas decorations. Aren't they beautiful? Like, how adorable is that? I'm so grateful for her. Her name is Joy. You guys have seen her in a few videos. We ride with her. She was a subscriber and a fan before we became friends. She made a gorgeous Stella. Oh, my heart is, like, beating fast just from holding this. She made that one. She made a Finn. No, that's a Gracie. Wait, this is Storm. The other one was Willow, but how kind is that? How amazing is that though? She made those for us. I love them. And every single year, Stella will have a spot on our Christmas tree because of her. Also, I wanted to show you one last thing. Do you guys remember the story of this ornament that says Sophia on it? It says it right there. If you are an OG member, then you probably know the story of this. This ornament but I'm going to actually um, move that video that I talked about this ornament over onto my channel which is Journey to Greatness because this year is going to be the year of our channel Journey to Greatness. I plan to share all the ways that God has changed our lives and worked magic in our lives and I'm also going to try and tell show you guys how to get God more active in your lives and to recognize how God is working in your lives. That is going to be on that channel, Journey to Greatness. And if you're interested in that, you should definitely go and follow me over there because this is going to be the year that I work on that channel. Also, thank you to all of you guys who sent us Christmas cards this year. I appreciated it. I read every single one of them. This is our New Year's brunch. We have a lot more coming. These are the best things, though, you guys. These are macaroni and cheese balls with spinach. Mmm. Do you like them? Do you like the macaroni and cheese ball? No? Yeah, Did you try the macaroni and cheese ball? I took a little bit of everything. You took a little Except bit of everything? The two things that I don't want. Hi, gorgeous. Hello. Our first time in our new barn this year. God works in such mysterious ways, you guys. Gabby has not seen Sky. In like days and days because everything that's been going on she's been away and then her friend's been here <laughs> Hi, you can't come in <laughs> No. Hello princess Hello princess number two over there with your back to us Hello We don't leave this door open because 
This guy stands here and looks at the hay. Ah, I'm worried she would jump, make a jump for it, because that's the kind of girl she is. Well, hello, little girl. I know, I'm the booger queen. I booger queen. You might as well just get used to it. This is what I do. This is just who I am. So today, Sam came down to, what did he come down for? Sam came down to do something in the morning, and he found Sky dead. I shouldn't say that because people get emotional. I understand why. Um, but he was freaking out. He found her. This is how she lays. She lays down completely spread eagle, like her on her side, her head thrown back, and her legs straight out in front of her. And he's like, I looked at her, and I thought for sure she was dead. And he just started walking toward her, and she did not move a muscle. And then she heard him, and she jumped up. And I'm like, yeah, it's scary. It's scary as heck. And I phoned Fiona, and I said, your horse is killing us. <laughs> But it's just, and but Fiona thinks that she just has never really had any place to stretch out and lay that's super comfy. So, yeah, that's what she thinks she's doing. Still can't get over this horse. She's literally got so many muscles in this neck, though. She's literally the most passive horse I've ever seen in my life. Did you guys see yesterday in yesterday's video? Oh, Gracie, you'd be looking rough. Did you guys see in yesterday's video where? Hi, <laughs> hello. You're dirty. Where Hendrix jumped on Skye's back. He jumped on her back and then she walked away. Totally unsure what the heck was on her back. But she walked so careful and so gentle so that she wouldn't dislodge him from her back. I'm telling you, she's going to be an amazing horse. I just feel it in my bones. She might not be the fastest horse though. I think that she's a beginner horse in the making. A perfect lesson horse. Anyway, I'm going to do chores. Girls are gone to Starbucks and they're gonna come back and then we're gonna do the very first thing that I want to do in 2020. Sky, come here Sky. Come here. <laughs> Good girl. So this time I will not give her a treat. Good girl. Good girl. Yes, you came. <laughs> I think she's probably pretty trainable. Aren't you? Nice Christmas I'm jeans. A belt. Wow, looking good. Whoa, wait, you're still here? Yes. <laughs> the plan was for her to go home, but if she wants to do camp tomorrow, then she's gonna have to stay. So the plan was for her to go home, but if she wants to go to camp tomorrow, she has to stay. Mm -hmm. So are you going to camp tomorrow? Yeah. You're almost as tall as Gabby. What? Oh no, that's Oh no, I'm not even joking. Turn around back to back. Okay. Holy heck, Gabby, you're slowing Who's down. Me or sure. Bailey? Me. Turn around. No, it's a lot taller. Whoa. I know I'm short. Everybody was so tall in the store one day and I was just the smallest one in the store. I'm like, Gabby's like, please let me be short. Please God, please God, let me be short. Pony's pusher for life. Okay, hurry up, get uh, the big horse in here. Gabby was always the tallest kid. She was almost 20, she was almost two feet long when she was born. So was Nick and Nick is six foot four. And he was always head and shoulders taller than every kid in her class, in her age, since she was a baby. Like she's always been, nobody, we've never met other people taller than her. And suddenly she's in grade seven and almost 13 and she's still short. <laughs> and she's shorter and I've heard that that does happen, but there are no short women in um, either mine or Sam's family. So I don't know what the heck is happening. I brushed and hooked her you know? You brushed and hooked, picked her, tell them what's... Yeah, and you guys look at her blanket is wrecking her hair. I don't know how to fix that. It's because um people slide it is forward. It, who's? Oh, she's it's, got so. She's is that a spot? No, it's just hair messed it's up. It's just hair messed up. So who slides it forward? It's the blanket we doing it. We it off over her head. That's not enough to make it stand up like that. It's been standing up like that for days, and it's been driving me bonkers. Okay, so Skye has learned a new trick. Show them how you open the door, Skye. Show them how you get in here. When she wants in, she puts her nose on the door handle. She puts her nose on the handle and tries to... Watch, let's see if she does it. Come on in. She knows how to do it. She knows that's how you get in. She puts her, no her nose there and then tries to open the door with it. Yeah. Were you a human before? I think so. In 2019, I learned that the fastest way to a horse's heart is by doing nice things for them. And when we first moved here, Hold that. we started walking our horses, taking them on long walks and getting them used to this area. And we're going to start 2020 off doing the same way. New horse, 
new walks, new journey. Said to me, to me, it seems like you like me too. We can't take it. Oh. That's a happy sound. Help! It's inside out. Grab it from here. You're excited? Yeah. Okay, we'll go Talking to the night into the morning, building cat mystery. I don't think I ever want to go come closer next to me. Trying to find another way to say this, but I think, I think we were meant to be. You make me anxious. I think I might be stuck on you. There's no need to rush, so let's just take our time Dropping everything cause you're stuck on my mind, my mind. Turn her and face the car Good girl! I hear Kaylee. She's not gonna eat you. She's not gonna eat you. Good girl. We're playing good She's Barbie like, pony. <laughs> yeah. Well, she I'm looks like be Barbie. A spider and I'm gonna be a spider web. Oh, that's good. I'm gonna be Barbie and Barbie's pony because Barbie's pony looks like Gracie. I know, but it's not Barbie's pony. It's Skipper. You look like no, Skipper. No, it's Chelsea. Barbie. Barbie has no, bigger I boobs. Hair. Barbie has bigger boobs. I will stop in my bra. <laughs> okay. Come on, let's keep going. Me catch. Mom. Um, You're okay. Okay. Keep going. No, we're being Barbie and Barbie and Sunny and Stephanie. You heard it here, folks. Kaylee steps her bra. <laughs> no, 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 right now. Just joking. So just sit. With me, talking to the night into the morning, building cat mystery. I don't think I ever want. She's doing great. <laughs> we can. Whoa, it is slippery. We're gonna go back because it's a little slippery. Wait, how did this guy go in the front? Why do you have to be in the front, Gabby? Let her. Oh, see. Gabby is very good at uh, bomb-proofing bomb -proofing horses. I'm telling you right now. Gabby is really good at bomb-proofing horses and making people never want children. But I say that with love in my heart, you guys. <laughs> Own it, right? With me, talking to the night into the morning, building cat mystery. I don't think I ever want to go come closer next. Trying to find another way to say this, but I think, I think we were meant to be. Oh, we were meant to be. Oh, we were meant to be. Oh, we were meant to be. So just sit with me, talking through the night and through the morning. Say this.